Here we go, Sam. That's it. Hello, I'm Andy, and this is Sam. Sam is a baby elephant, or calf. Now, elephants like to eat a lot of food. In fact, they can eat twice my body weight, which is loads. In the wild, they'll eat leaves and plants and trees. I'm feeding Sam here some bananas. There we go, Sam. All over the world, wild baby animals are learning what to eat and how to eat it. First stop, the Kalahari Desert in South Africa. This meerkat pup is just two months old and she's about to have a very big day. She lives here in the desert with her family and friends in a big gang called a mob. They always make sure she has enough to eat, but now it's time to start catching her own food. A yummy meal for a meerkat is very different from the food you or I like to eat. First course, ants. Be careful, little meerkat. This dinner bites back. Mmm, delicious. Oh, for a meerkat, that is. And if you thought that first course was strange, just look at what's for the main course. A scorpion. Our mini meerkat will have to watch out for nasty nipping claws and a painful stinging tail. It might seem a bit dangerous to you and me, but a scorpion sting doesn't hurt too much if you're a meerkat. Don't think the scorpion is very keen on being dinner, though. Whoa. Yikes! <laughs> Catching your own dinner isn't so easy after all. At least when you live in a big gang, there's always someone close by to help keep an eye on you and make sure you're doing it right. There, she's done it. Well done, you. Well done. Catching your own dinner is a big step on your journey to becoming a grown-up meerkat. Maybe next time, you can show these pups how to catch a scorpion. Hello, I'm Andy, and this is a baby crocodile, or hatchling. Now, the mum crocodiles are some of the best parents in the world, because they don't just look after their babies, they look after the babies of other crocodiles too. They're fantastic team players. Now, the baby crocs, they grow up in what's called a crocodile creche. Teamwork is really important when you start out in life. How about a trip to Namibia in Africa? The sun is peeping over the horizon, and for one young animal, that means it's time to go to work. This little meerkat pup is on lookout duty today. He's less than a year old, and it's his first time doing this very important job. Oh, where's he off to? Ah, good idea. If you climb up there, you'll be able to see much further. And with you looking out for danger, the rest of your family can safely have breakfast. Oh, maybe it wasn't such a good idea after all. Never mind. I'm sure you'll get the hang of it soon. Just be careful that branch doesn't break. Time to find a new lookout post. Uh-oh. Here comes trouble. This scary-looking character is a Cape Cobra. He's got a nasty, venomous bite. So he's a real threat to this pup and his family. But should he tackle it by himself? 
or call for help. Ah, yes. Good choice, little meerkat. Call for help. This guy is far too tough to tackle on your own. Here come the reinforcements. A group of meerkats is called a mob. And when they all get together and work as a team, they can be a pretty formidable force. Now it's 15 meerkats against just one snake. Careful, everyone. Watch out for that venomous bite. Oh, look. He's off. Not such a tough guy after all, eh? Teamwork saves the day. Well done, young pup. Now run on home for your supper. <laughs>